two days, eight channels, one creator's champion. <laughs> Welcome to the first annual Creators Cup, the first of its kind. Two qualifier events followed by a match play championship where winner takes all. Only one creator can reign supreme and be known as the best disc golf YouTube channel out there. Who do you think will take home the cup? Want to look fresh on the disc golf course? Well, polos are a thing of the past. Find your new style today at Flippy Disc Golf. Flippy creates super soft, stretchy, and lightweight jerseys with men and women in mind. The lightweight, moisture-wicking fabric keeps you cool on the course and lets you throw smoothly and freely without any snagging or sticking. Flippy also offers customization to your jerseys, perfect for tournament players packs, doubles teams, and sponsored players. All Foundation viewers receive 10% off with code FOUNDATION10 at checkout. You can order now online at flippydiscgolf.com. The link is in the description, and make sure to check out the new Foundation jerseys that are going to be available today. You don't want to miss them. Thanks once again to Flippy Disc off for making this trip possible. We couldn't have done it without him. All right, Hunter. Mm -hmm. It's the final round of the Creators Cup. Yeah. You have found your way into the final round. Mm -hmm. What is the one and only thing on your mind? Well, here's the deal. We're playing for $500 out here, and obviously the cup. But I made a promise to Connor and Silas prior to stepping into this that if I were to win it on Sunday, today, Five hundred dollars. I'd split between them, two fifty each. So to be honest with you, I'm playing for nothing. So therefore, I feel no pressure. But I know Connor and Silas feel a lot of pressure. I will be apply applying me. more pressure than you've ever felt in your life. I think I think I feel pressure on the front nine to make it to the back nine, so that I have the power to throw and watch them squirm. As they see two. Man, I know how bad you each. want that cup. You picked out that cup online. I, I know I that you want cup. it so bad. But I wouldn't say I wanted so bad. I'm trying to make. I wanted to make it. I wanted to make it. I cared about getting to today. As a channel, I didn't care if it was me or Trevor here, because that would have been very embarrassing. I think that I can say collectively for all. But we got it here. That we want. That we want that cup in the office. I know. I know. But we, Trevor, we how badly do you want that cup in the office? Uh, I I want the cup because mostly. I'm the type of guy, it's like, I hate losing more than I like winning. So, like, for me, it's just like, I don't want those other channels having it. I just no, like, I understand. I That's, just like the idea that, It was that, just like, like, oh, we didn't win, whatever, blah, blah, blah. But, like, the fact that I would know that the trophy is sitting on their channel and they would just be showing it off, beating us. Yeah, like, you want Robbie I waking want, up every morning, no. dancing in front of I it, want, looking at his reflection? I want channel supremacy. I just like the fact that I have the power of like yeah you hunter and power it's a match made in heaven you know i gotta fit i i just gotta flip a coin to decide which way i want this to go hunter that is bull honky dude no, also, hunter's a liar you also know he's gonna try as hard as liar. he can but I, I will try my best for you too main thing on my mind is i want to not be able to speak tomorrow because i am yelling so loud cheering <laughs> for other people who throw in pretty sick shots mm. That's my goal. Like, if we throw good shots, yeah, sure, like, that's nice. But, like, straight up, I don't expect to throw good shots. I think I threw literally all of them yesterday. Uh, <laughs> so I'm just going to root for the other people who think that I'm a threat. Mm, that, that's a good way. You know, and that's also a double whammy because it's a good way to get in their head, too. Yeah, they're like, oh, I like, kill them with kindness. Yeah. I'm not trying to kill them. I'm trying to, like, full uh, Josh Groban raise them up. Um, so... I was saying uh, whenever we were sitting over there that I think yesterday, at whenever you would dance to get out of your own head, I think you were getting right into Hunter's head. <laughs> hey, I'm just saying, I've never seen Hunter dance when he's lining a putt up, That's and true. I've never been on the Foundation channel and danced and missed a putt. Wow. That's a good point. So, are they connected? Maybe not, but uh, he should try it. Uh, I feel like Hunter could dance. You have, uh, because of your extreme putting abilities, you have <laughs> found your way here in the final round of the Creators' Cup. What is the one thing on your mind? One thing on my mind uh, is to commit to my putts, to actually follow through, make sure that I get it there, because I hit the basket way too many times yesterday on easy putts, and just making sure I commit, I think that'll help me move.
What is it that you think got you here to the final round of the Creators Cup? Oh, definitely my lucky bag hit on uh, the 300 foot approach shot. <laughs> it's like, that was like, I was not playing well, didn't throw my distance drive well, didn't do my 250 approach as well, hit the bag, and I was like, let's do this, let's go. That's so, awesome. Kind of knocked off the nerves and jitters and just like all right let's just let's do this so that was if i didn't hit the bag who knows <laughs> who knows what happened now going but, this round what is the one thing going on in your mind oh man dude i feel like Ro robbie and molt are like the same at putting like they're both like consistent and solid and i feel like me and hunter are the same at putting in, in terms of like it's literally a coin flip like <laughs> like we like Either one of us, we could come out here, be missing our 15 footers, and need to be inside 15 feet the whole round, or we can come out here and just light it up on the green. And so, like, whichever, whichever one person does that, like, if it's if it's that person's day, it's like the other person's not 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 going to happen. So nice. So we'll see, but uh, I woke up feeling dangerous today. So. All right, I want to ask you one yeah, more question. Good. <laughs> Are you intimidated by Robbie C's dancing? Oh my gosh, I'm usually not, but. The fact that he's been killing it this weekend it makes it just like that much more scary. It's just like that that man is that that man's lethal. Are you intimidated by Robbie C's dancing? If I was at a wedding, yes. But on the disc golf course, no chance. Are you intimidated by Robbie C's dancing? In the wise words of Shakira, those hips don't lie. And when someone is that loose and fluid, you know exactly what's going on between their ears and it's a scary sight. It's a scary sight. In the wise words of Shakira, those yips don't lie because everybody else is going to have the yips out there. What Travis said. <laughs> An incredible event has led to this moment. Four channels are left. We've got two big matchups here on the front nine. They'll go head to head in a match play event. Winners will then advance to the back nine for the chance to win the first ever Creators Cup. We are here on hole one, back where it all began. We'll see what they got today. A lot of pressure. We got some spectators in the house. We got $500 on the line. Woo! We've got a dog in the background. <laughs> Anything is possible. Let's start it off. First to the tee, after dominating the field events and dominating the singles match, we have Robbie C. Woo! Woo! Pizza Boys! Guaranteed a Pizza Boy is going to win this match. <laughs> oh wow! This, this this first match. Those are fighting words. This first match. Oh, the uh, first match. That makes sense. <laughs> looks good. Head right at it. Oh, this yeah. is all the trees. In the hole. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Good shot, Robbie. Good shot. Next on the tee, after one of the more incredible putting performances I've ever seen, Molt. Woo! Woo! Yeah. Oh. 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 Ooh. That's a raise. That's a raise. After starting off hot yesterday in the singles match, going 400 through the first five, we have Hunter with foundation. Yeah. Don't worry about what happened after that. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I deleted the footage, so it doesn't matter. Oh yes, my. Hunter. Get off, Get off of it. All right, it's a putt. That man's never been scared of a putt in his life. The only one to hit the bag in the accuracy contest. We have the man himself, Apollo. <laughs> Who do you think the crowd favorite is yeah. to win? Crowd favorite's probably one of the pizza boys, honestly. I'm not sure which one, it's hard to say. A lot of cheers for both. The interesting thing for me is to, obviously everyone right now is comfortable with playing in front of a camera. They've done it many, many times. Some people maybe even have been comfortable playing in a tournament format. However, we have four, $500 on the line today and the first ever Creators Cup. That adds a lot of pressure. We'll see who's ready for it. Oh, good bid. Oh, way. He just doesn't miss them. He just doesn't miss them ever. So, a quick just explanation of match play for everyone since it's not really used as much in disc golf. We had a tie there, which is also a push. 
it doesn't actually go on to the second hole. So this hole's not worth two. You can only get really one point or one hole per hole. So that's his halved. Robbie wins the first hole, goes one up. He starts hole two. Probably one of the harder birdies out on the course out here. Got to fit it through the limbs, push all the way up into the tree line, give yourself a putt. Brody told me it was a, a or mid-range yesterday, and I threw a fairway driver, so. Hey, whatever works for you, man. I like, to, I like to shift responsibility. Yeah. Oh, be here. Push, push, push. Nice shot. Settle Stay right there. there. Yeah. yeah, see, that's the thing. Brody's never been wrong before. All right. Oh, shot. It's a pole cap. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh it's yeah. perfect. Yeah. Oh, get oh. in the gap. Let's go. In the gap. Yes. Ooh, oh, good shot. Oh, yeah, all right. That'll be just fine. Right if it gets out of it a little bit. Kick left. Ooh. All right. You're up there. That's all right. No, that's not flipping. No way. All right. All right. It's fine. <laughs> Good up. Oh my. Yeah. That just would have been so cool. Yes, Hunter, thank you. With that, Hunter takes a one-up lead. Robbie C maintains his one-up lead. We move on to hole three, the first wooded hole of the course. You got a flex forehand option. You got a hyzer pushing backhand. You can cut off the corner with the backhand. A lot of options. Let's see what everyone does. That was good. Great. Oh, that's oh, yeah. Nice Get some change. Good job. Come on. Pizza boys. <laughs> Oh, that looks good too. Kick something. Oh, it did. Oh, it did. Oh, it did. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Same, same spot you were in yesterday. Yeah, yeah that looks good. That looks good. Oh, that looks like mine. That's perfect. Great shot. Oh man. Good bid. Smile cam. There it is. Dang. Good putt. Hole four, 242 feet. A couple options you can do. You can either throw a lower speed disc. That's going to be kind of hyzer pushing around the corner to the left. You throw a higher speed disc and try to get that flare skip to get over there, see what they do. I want to ask you while you're on the tee, Robbie, yeah. if you could choose one restaurant for the pizza on your shirt to be from, what would that be? 100%. I have no idea. Uh, DiGiorno's? Uh, DiGiorno's. Ooh. Ooh, not that's delivery. interesting. It's not delivery. That way I can stay at home and watch content on the Foundation, on the Foundation Podcast Network. <laughs> Oh, that was Ooh. Sick. That was a good throw. Should have said Little Caesars. All right, Molt, same question for you. Where's the pizza on your shirt from? Pizza Exchange. It's a little small shop in Whoa. Matthews, North Carolina. That is that is Whoa. just so that is so cool and hipster. I'm jealous. Shop local. Oh, look at it. Ooh. You don't have pizza on your shirt, so I'm not asking you any questions. Oh, Oh man. Yeah, good up, Hunter. Let's go, baby. No. Oh my oh, gosh. Come on. Oh, oh my goodness. Mm. Yep. 
We made it to the par four. First par four on this course that lets you really kind of open up and rip it a little bit. Uh, you do have a low ceiling to kind of push the disc through. If you get something past that kind of grove of trees there on the right, you should have a pretty easy upshot to make your birdie. We'll see how aggressive they get off the tee. Just get right, just get right. Oh. Wow. Ooh, Ooh that looks like it could be good. Oh, get through it all. Let's go. Yeah, he uh, took the right of it. Oh, oh, oh man. That has so much oh, snap. He is massive. Hunter wow. right through there. Oh, God. Oh, put a move on. Come on, Hunter. It's huge. Boom. Oh, that oh, looks here. good. Yeah. That looks really good. Yeah, yeah. Get, through, get through there. Get through, get through. Get right yeah. Oh, good shot, good, good shot. Good shot. Go, Love it. Yep, get up there. Come on. Wow. 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 Holy crap. Oh, it's smooth yeah, like it's butter. Come on. Somewhere a K-pop band. Right. Good, good shot. Good shot. Dude, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm right by your mic. <laughs> good up, Hunter. Good up. All right. All right. Love this guy. Oh, he doesn't have a toothpaste sponsor. We're obviously sponsored by Colgate and T Pain. No, oh, yeah, he actually dances. And watch now, he's gonna bang it 100. percent like, I would bet my life on him making this putt. After he dances, there's no way. It's incredible. Bring it, Robbie. Come on. Go. Ooh. I, I think I'm a competitive person, but I've found that there are more competitive people out there that are willing to do things like dance to get out of their own head, and then I'm like, oh, I'm not competitive. <laughs> Good putt, good putt. Moving on to hole six now, it's a par three, 345 feet. You can go aggressive line if you want that stock kind of hyzer over the baseball field and kind of stick it in there. I think we're gonna see a lot more forehands, backhand turnovers. Um, obviously the baseball field is OB, so if you go in there, you probably are gonna lose a hole. That looks good. Oh, yeah. Over. Yeah, that's yep, that's fantastic. Good shot. Good shot. Yeah, good shot, Robbie. Good shot, Robbie. Come on. Pizza boys. Pizza boys. Skip. Yeah, Hunter, that'll play. Good job. Oh, that looks good. Yep. Oh, man. It looks so good out of the hand. It's all right. Bring it up. Hey, it looks nice. That would be cool. Oh, my gosh. It looks like a fox with his tower right there. That's why this that's why this shot is so lackluster. That shot is this shot is so lackluster because I don't want to walk over there because I'm on an island right now. Island boy. Swam across, we made it. Hole seven, par four, four thirty-three. You need power off the tee, but you also need placement. You need to get it all the way to the left because the basket is tucked in pretty tight to the right. It's gonna have to take two good shots to get your birdie here. Yeah, that's good right there. That's oh, yeah. very good. It's a great spot. Good shot. Good shot. Pizza boys. boys. I've never seen so much teamwork from competitors. <laughs> flip, baby. Flip. Be that race. Let's get through it all. Through it all. He's done it. That's great. Oh, my goodness. And the athleticism. Oh, and that'll... That's oh good. My. Get off the trees. Stay low. That'll be fine. Sit down. Chill out. 
Good shot. Oh, that's good. Hey, Danny. Sir. Based off of what you've seen so far this round, mm -hmm. who do you think the favorite is to win? I think. I think. Who you, yeah, who would you say is being the most dynamic? I right think now? Robbie's mental is about to crumble. Oh man! And I think Molt is about to come back. Dang. Yeah. I don't, so, I don't wish it on him, but I just feel like it's so going to happen. So who, who are, yeah. who's your prediction going into the uh, final, the back nine? I got to go with Molt and Hunter. Dang. The, the total winter, total winner, I think is going to be Hunter. Okay. Mm. All right. That's great. Great shot. Oh man, we've got a lot of brain power standing right there right now. Molt's in a really good position right now to win this hole, which would put them at even with two to play. Hunter's up two right now, and if he wins this hole, it's over. Hmm. Oh, good kick. Pick it up, Bolt. Ooh, it's okay. Right. Gonna have to. Good fight. fight. Trevor, what are, what are your thoughts right now? Um, here's my thoughts. Hunter needs to put the nail in the coffin. And Mole is running away with this thing. All right, Robbie. I normally wouldn't bother you while you're obviously trying to get your head in the game, but this is a content. This is for content. It's for the content, baby. So I've got to know what's going through your head right now. Uh, there's a video that I'm going to be making about like weaknesses in your game and there's like a weird world when you don't feel confident putting a certain type of disc in your hand or like your weakness shows up and it shakes you mentally. I feel like I'm buttery smooth but I hate throwing distance drivers so the only two holes that I've given up are the distance drivers holes. So uh, we're back to a polecat and I'm like alright let's jam to some Katy Perry get back in the zone and throw a polecat ace. Why not? Let's go in. To set the stage here guys we have an update on the matches. Robbie C. Molt. All square right now. Hunter and Apollo, they are now, Hunter is dormy, which is a f fancy word is basically say he can't lose in the nine hole match. Now Apollo needs to go back to back wins to push it to a playoff. We have a beautiful hole to set this match up right here. It's only 150 feet off the tee, but it is a daunting one with the two Mandos sitting roughly about 12 feet apart. You miss the Mando, you re-tee, a lot of strategy to see if some people might jump putt to lay up and force the other person to try to go for the birdie. Ooh. Anything can happen. Let's see how they do it. That's in. That's through. That's through. That is a three. Do you ever feel like a plastic bag? That's it. That's it. Oh my gosh. Six shot, Robbie. This guy is made out of cast iron. Thank you, Katie. I appreciate it. <laughs> You're welcome. I'll answer for her. That is in that gap. That is about as pure as possible. Come on, Hunter. That's huge. Hey, he's still. I mean, you can throw, throw it in. If he wait, aced wait, from here, you should throw another one. Yeah, if he aced in here and then Hunter misses the putt. Please. Oh, okay. You are consistent. Go. All right, David. You are just now, literally just now, you've just lost the match. I want to know what's going through <laughs> your head right now. I mean, I'm, I'm not... asking aggressive questions because we are content creators, so oh, we've yeah. got to do the content. I mean, I'm not. I'm not too upset. I just made a like. Like I didn't play terrible. I just made a few mistakes, but those. I lost the hole on every one of those mistakes, so Hunter just capitalized. So. And overall, you made it to the finals of the very first Creators Cup. So how does that make you feel? Dude, that was the goal. That's all I wanted to do. I was just like, just get to the final day, and that's golden. Whatever happens, just don't choke. And I feel like I didn't choke, so. <laughs> you know what I mean? now, now, final thing, get, just smack the camera. Just smack the camera. Oh, come on! Come on! Pizza boys! So good, baby! Alright, with that, Hunter advances to the final nine. 
to try to be the first to take home the Creators Cup after an electric putt. Molt, Robbie C, all square, one to play. That was electric. We got a uh, 256 par three, a little bit around the corner. It looks like there's some puddle situation. So you just gotta fight past the puddle, get a skip, give yourself a putt. All right, gotta interrupt the video real quick. As you may know, we are on a quest to 100,000 subscribers before the end of the year, and every 5,000 subscribers, we're doing an awesome giveaway, as well as donating a nickel to charity to the Isaiah 117 house for every subscriber that we gain. So we've already been able to donate a ton, and we're getting subscribers quickly. However, we gotta get some more to get to that 80,000 benchmark. We're getting super close. This is the giveaway. We're giving away the foundation summer stamp, a full set here. We got two drivers, a mid and a putter. And guess what? The giveaways are just gonna keep getting better. So make sure if you haven't already, go down, look down, click that subscribe button, and then you can return to the video. You're not gonna wanna miss that 100,000 sweepstakes giveaway. It's gonna be incredible. The giveaways are just gonna keep getting better, so make sure to subscribe, and we're also gonna keep donating a nickel for every subscriber we get. So let's hop back into the video now. Oh, come on. Mm. Oh my. Yeah, that looks good. Push, that looks good. Push. Good shot, Robbie. Good shot, Robbie. Oh, that's a good bid. That's a good bid. Come on, Robbie. Great match. Great match. So much just lost. So you just literally just now, seconds ago, officially lost the Creators Cup. Yeah. What is it that's going through your head? Uh, I couldn't have lost to anybody better, and I'm happy that I pushed it to the last hole. Mm -hmm. So that's if I could have done it anyway, that would have been it. Besides winning. Are we? You think we could see you out here next year? Oh heck yeah, man! Oh, I'm only yeah. I'm up in the, the road in Charlotte, so not far. All right, go ahead and smack your way out of this competition. All right, with that we have our finals. Hunter from Foundation. Robbie C have both made it after incredible matches by both of them. We are moving on to the back nine here. Hole 10, par four, plays like probably 450 I'm assuming, but you can't really get too much off the tee. It's a very, very technical tee shot. You have to be in a really, really good spot on the left-hand side to give you any sort of angle into the basket. A pretty good starting hole for these guys to show us what they got. Again? That's a good shot. Come on. A little early. Keep that's going, good. It's a sky forehand roller from that. Yeah. yeah, Hunter. That's so good. Uh, yeah. Ooh, that's okay. That's okay. Yeah. That's okay. Yep. Yep. Tight, tight. Oh, that's oh, good, Hunter. Oh, my goodness. My goodness, my stars. <laughs> I love that guy. Come on. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Dang. Oh, man. Good bid. Good bid. There, now we're talking some concedes. Hole 11, par three, 193. Gotta go just right of these trees, hug kind of the right hand side, and then you either need a big flare skip again, or you kind of need a hyzer pushing shot. It is tucked pretty far back to the right. So to get this one parked is an incredible shot, but I think they're looking mostly to try to get like a 30 footer for their birdies. Ooh. That is great. That that's pretty good. That's, right, that's pretty like good. That's exactly under. what you threw yesterday. Yeah, yeah. Nah, it was a little, little inside. Was it? Oh, yeah. That's so good. Off a bit. It's in. Right. It's in. Uh, oh, that's good. Oh. Hey, that's a putt. That's a Robbie C putt right there. Oh, my gosh. Come on, Robbie. Come on. Oh, come on, Hunter! Come on, Hunter! Wow. Two massive putts there. Hunter goes two up. We're on hole 12, par three, 277 feet. You got the light pole kind of right there where that bush is. You want to push something forward through the gap and then have it hyzer out to give yourself the best chance at birdie. 
That looks really That's good. Perfect. That might go in. That's perfect. Yep. Oh. Oh, it's fine. yep, that's great, Hunter. Great, Hunter. Oh, oh. gyro. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, Get out. Dang. Get out. Alright, long putt potential. Hey, another putt. Anytime. You got those. I'm just kidding. That'd be right. That'd be I was about right. to say. <laughs> you guys don't see that line just like right through. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was a pretty sick bid though. Yeah, good too, Hunter. Right. We've made it to hole 13, the island hole. Just under 200 feet. Island you see hole. it right there in front of you. You don't make the island, you're OB, you gotta go to the drop zone. It is just looking for someone to ring this one up. Oh. Hunter, that's so good. Oh! You sit down. All right. No, that's fine. Settle. Good throw, Hunter. Settle? Yes, Settle? yes. On the back. On the back. Back. That is what we Real call a fairway hit. Oh, wait. Stalling. Come on back. Coming back in. Oh, it's parked. Oh, yeah. yeah. Good shot, Robbie. Good shot, Robbie. Good putt, Hunter. Sneaky, sneaky putt right there. All right, we got the Spiky boys over here. What, what, what do you guys think? What, what? Bro, Hunter is dialed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and when he misses, it still went in. It's a man on a mission. <laughs> Predictions for the rest of this round? Comeback win from Robbie. Hot take. Wow. <laughs> I wow. Think Robbie, it. I think Robbie might get a couple back, but I think Hunter's yeah. got it right now. Hole 14, 363 feet. You gotta throw a good shot to give yourself a chance, but you also need a little bit of a luck because the gap is not, it's not really there, let's be honest. So you're trying to throw it up there, try to crash through the trees, give yourself a look, and see if you can make the putt. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yep, that's good. Get in, get in there. Yep, that's great. Get the man playing disc golf, not playing silly, silly disc golf. You ain't gonna touch him, brothers. Get in the hole. Get left. Skip. Do something. Let's go. Oh. Heck yeah, Robbie. I would say I want to be a toxic, a toxic pole cat thrower. Yeah. Uh, that's what I want to be. I just want that personality. I, I, am I a toxic pole cat thrower? I mean, yeah. Am I toxic? Yeah. Oh, no, no, oh. toxic. Not toxic in a bad. Toxic like Britney Spears. Not toxic like okay. poison. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Alright, Hunter. Yeah. 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 Heck yeah, Hunter! Come on, Hunter! Heck yeah, Hunter! Come on. Hole 15, 192. The locals will tell you this is a hyzer play. I would tell you it's not. It is a forehand out to the left, push up into the trees, and give yourself a putt. If we see someone go the hyzer route, that'll be exciting, though. The hyzer is just so far from the play here, it seems. Like, it's just, like, yeah, it's just, just right there. Oh, it oh. I, I, I love it. <laughs> My heart strings are broken. <laughs> that's good, Hunter. Oh, 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 that's a that putt. Okay. That's in range. Come on. That got <laughs> Did you see how this man's putting today? That is in range. Oh, get right. Oh. Be a firebird. Or uh, what do you throw? Cap wrap? Big. big. All right. Be a cap wrap. Too long putt. Too long <laughs> Low pig. <laughs> Hunter has this putt for the win. For the win? For the win. Oh, Connor had. <laughs> I've never actually not hit metal on a step putt. I run that hard. <laughs> this is what happened. <laughs> Way harder putt. Oh. oh. That makes oh. things very interesting. Hole 16 with that, Robbie slices the lead a little bit, going two up with three to play for Hunter. Hole 16 is 253 feet. Lots of different options off the tee. You can go through the left gap or the right gap. You can play the forehand, backhand, hyzer, turnover, a lot of different options. Really, whatever your best shot is, this is the one that you're going to want to throw. Come on, flip out of that tree. Take your back. Yeah, Hunter. Ooh. 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 Okay. Not quite a putt. Silas, as a content creator yourself, would you say that content is being created right now? Oh, very much so. I mean, we've had putts after putts. You know, we saw, saw Molt's putt. We saw Robbie's freaking just gas of a putt, man. I mean, that thing was just drained. 
so many putts going on. It's unreal. This course, this course is just, it's an even playing field right now and anyone can win, anybody. Let's go Poppy. Yeah, that'll do. That's fine. It's fine. Good putt, good putt. All right, the match has moved to Dormy. Two holes left, Hunter play is up two, which basically means Robbie C has to win these next two holes back to back to force it into a playoff. We've got a fun one here, 200 feet on hole 17. You definitely got a tunnel to have to throw it through. The basket is just on the left-hand side. A straight shot will work, or you can, if you want to get underneath the basket, throw something straight that fades a little bit at the end. Yeah, that is pretty good. Oh, yeah. That is very good. Oh, it's so Very good. Very good. Hunter is so good. And Hunter ants. Oh! There's a putt left out there. Can you not see this? You're just coming through me. All right. Oh! Oh, my. So fun. Dreaded hole 18, Davy Jones locker. David. Just ask Danny about hole 18. I don't want to talk about hole 18. <laughs> <laughs> what if it was all rigged and all of a sudden, like Domino's actually was the sponsor of this event and like winning a playoff? Oh my gosh. Pizza for everybody! And then it's like, burr, 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 burr. yeah, like, yes, I'm just saying in the future. That is a great idea. Uh, Rigging it would be a good idea in the future. <laughs> We have made it somehow to hole 18. This is known as the hardest hole in Charleston, also known as the round ruiner. And for one of these two gentlemen, it might just ruin their day. We got 524 wow. feet, par four. OB all down the right-hand side with a baseball field. An ideal shot is probably gonna be just left of that light pole to give you a chance to throw up to the elevated basket that also sits on a hill. We might see some people Maybe jump putt to just outside the tunnel and then throw the big hyzer. A lot of options off the tee. Let's see how it plays out. Kick right. Kick right. Okay. Yeah, that's a step out forehand. Yeah, that's so good. Totally fine. Oh, whoa! <laughs> I thought that was going to climb the fence. If that would have climbed that fence, I'd have torn it down with bare hands. <laughs> oh, yeah. Staying alive. For level K. Spoke that one into existence, apparently. <laughs> yep. Good shot. And it's up. And it's down. Yep, yep, that's a good shot. Get in. My God. He just oh, made things. All right. <laughs> got the dance. We got the dance. We got the dance going. All right, game time. Oh. Good bid, Robbie. He, run it. Oh. Don't roll. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Hunter, bring it in, bring it in. Uh, I'm Terry with the Disc Golf Network. Now that you've just finished, we have an interview for you. Uh, <laughs> what is your thoughts on uh, you threw a bad shot one time today? Uh, hmm. What was going through your head on that? It was bad caddy advice. Okay, yeah. bad caddies. Don't. Trevor, Trevor told me to jump putt it up. It was definitely a throw. Um, he's not getting his 10%. That's all I can say about it. All right, fantastic, fantastic. Uh, terrible interview, but uh, thank you for coming by. Uh, congratulations on the win. Uh, uh, in the heat of the moment, after you immediately just lost the Creators Cup, Yeah. I want to know what's going through your head. Uh, I got down early. Uh, the fact that we made it to 18 feels really good. Uh, I just, I stand by, guys. Hunter is a good disc golfer. Uh, so all the people, people don't that, know. People, people do don't not know, know, right? Like they step up. Yes, he shanks some putts that like rec players make, but that's fine because when the pressure's on, the dude is like clutches all get out. So if you're not watching those putts, 
like several circles edgers nailed it i'm happy to lose team foundation all the way baby all right now i'm gonna need you to go ahead and slap yourself out of this competition game time here we go slap I want to say thanks to everyone that came out, to all the creators, all the fans, all the spectators. Incredible event. Thank you so much. We definitely have to do this again next year, but without further ado, the first ever 2022 winner of the Disc Golf Creators Cup, Foundation Disc Golf. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, yes, sir. Sir. yes sir. Don't get struck by lightning. You're gonna get struck by lightning. You're gonna get struck by lightning. Oh, no. Speech! Speech! Oh gosh! Yeah! Oh, wait, slap it. That's it. it Good, Trevor, slap it. Trevor, slap that camera, man. Oh, with the trophy.